why Roblox is better than Minecraft. Roblox has an advantage over Minecraft merely because of the vast number of game possibilities available. Roblox is more of a game engine or toolkit than a single game. Is Roblox on the other hand a better game than Minecraft? Let's get this party started. This is why. Roblox and Minecraft are two vastly different games in terms of gameplay and price structure, despite their comparable blocky and colorful aesthetic. For several years, there have been a back and forth dispute between Roblox and Minecraft. The two games appear to be very similar on the surface. Both games feature colorful graphics with blocky textures. Both games are even targeted to the same demographics, which are kids and members of the younger generations. However, when both games are truly compared and evaluated, they are immensely different. It is true that both games have sandbox potentials, but in dramatically different ways. On top of that, Roblox is more of a game engine than a standalone game like Minecraft. Let's break down the similarities and the differences between Minecraft and Roblox and determine which game is better to play in 2021. We definitely have those of us who enjoy playing Roblox like I do and others like Minecraft. What do you think about the two? I'll be reading the comment, but the first, let's define Minecraft. What is Minecraft? Minecraft is a computer game in which players explore a three-dimensional world composed of blocks. Despite the fact that it is a 3D game, the block structure gives it a fairly basic graphical style. While this may appear to be a disadvantage, it is actually a benefit. It's easier to render the game on computers, and youngsters prefer the classic visual approach. Minecraft is a sandbox game, which means there is no predetermined storyline to follow and everything is unlocked right away. Your youngsters is not required to do anything in order for the game to progress. Instead, they can start building and exploring right away, using everything in the game. Anything that is a purchase is an exception to this rule. Minecraft lets players reconstruct the world by manipulating blocks. There is an actual structure to the world in the form of different environments to explore. Players can manipulate the environments by traveling, adding blocks, or removing them. What is Roblox? Roblox is a newer sandbox game that is more like a gaming platform. In a nutshell, it's a collection of Roblox-based games. Roblox isn't a game, it's just a platform that allows other games to run smoothly. Players create a character and then select a game to play with that character. Roblox has a unique approach to visual by combining low-resolution designs with high-resolution pieces, yet it has a more Lego-like feel to it. Even the player characters have a Lego-like appearances, albeit with more advanced visuals. Roblox allows people to roam around the globe, interact with objects, form communities, and develop their own ideas. The game in Roblox are all made by players, with moderations and oversight by the Roblox development team. New games are added constantly and players can make their own games if they want to. In short, your child can try a game to experience what other players experience or create a game of their own for other players to enjoy. Roblox vs Minecraft Roblox and Minecraft are both tremendous gaming options with their own rights. Gamers who already have a favorite should feel free to continue playing the game that they enjoy the most. Gameplay Roblox has an advantage over Minecraft in terms of gameplay simply because of the sheer number of alternatives available. Roblox is more of a game engine or gaming toolkit than a single standalone game, as previously stated. Gamers can choose from a nearly limitless number of games, including what units and first-person shooters. They can even try to break out prison, race and collect pets, or reenact a day in life in a pizza delivery driver. Roblox users can even design and develop their own games, which they can play with their friends or complete strangers. Some of the very best games designers have the potential to make thousands of real dollars a month by creating new and popular games for Roblox. Minecraft is not that far behind though, as the game is home to a vibrant and incredibly talented modding community. As an added bonus, most of the most popular mods for Minecraft, at least on Java editions, can be obtained for free. The base versions of Minecraft is also a ton of fun in its own right, with several options of what to do or build. Players can strive to defeat the Ender Dragon, build the coolest house they can, or maybe even just hoard diamonds. However, the gameplay options for Roblox are just as fast. This is a tricky category to compare, and Roblox just barely edges out with a win over Minecraft. Price Structure Minecraft is by far the winner when it comes to total value. Minecraft is a standalone game that can be enjoyed indefinitely all for a single flat rate. After paying that single flat rate to buy Minecraft, players will not need to spend a penny more to enjoy the game. The continued major updates and patches for the game have all been historically free. Roblox, on the other hand, is a freemium game at its very core. 
The game may be free to play, but to truly experience all of the game options and collect some of the coolest and most sought after items, players will be required to spend real money. Roblox is dependent on in-game currency Robux to purchase items, pay for access to certain game modes, and pretty much everything in between. In order to make a good profit without spending real-life money, players will have to create and monetize their own content. However, not every person has the time or ability to successfully design their own games or items, so they are likely to resort to purchasing Robux in order to access all that Roblox has to offer. Roblox Premium is a great place to start to get the most value, but even that costs between $4.99 and $19.99 a month. Which of the two is the right program for your child? Minecraft and Roblox are the most popular sandbox video games in the world. It is common knowledge that children like playing these video games. The most popular online games for youngsters are Minecraft and Roblox. As parents, we are concerned about how much time our children spend playing these games and how much benefit they derive from them. The good news is that there is growing evidence that video games are beneficial for children and give benefits that go beyond amusement. Technology has advanced in recent years that it has enabled the creations of online worlds and communities for kids to explore, design, and share. In particular, a sector of games known as sandbox games helps promote creativity and teach kids self-directions, critical thinking, and problem-solving skills. Instead of focusing on linear gameplay and the needs to pass levels, sandbox games lets players freely explore and create worlds. Minecraft and Roblox are the world's leading sandbox video games. As a parent, you will want to know which one is better for your child to play. While these games have a lot in common, they also have distinct differences that can help you decide. Here's a look at Roblox and Minecraft, including similarities and differences to help you decide which one is right for your kid. The option you will choose will determine which platform you will use. Minecraft is better options if you are concerned about who your youngsters connects with online. While Roblox actively monitors its content and forums, this does not imply that they can guarantee a content-free experience. If you don't want to invest any money upfront for your kid to try the game, Roblox is best choice. However, your child will need to learn more about coding to create new content for Roblox, which can be a good thing or a hindrance to fully enjoying the game. If you don't mind investing upfront for a single-player game, then Minecraft is a better option. There are plenty of ways to upgrade later, and you don't have the same community content issues. However, your child won't have access to more detailed coding systems, so they won't learn that as a real-world skill. Whichever option you choose, Roblox and Minecraft can be effective ways of learning game design and coding skills. So, in 2021, which games is better? The answer is that it varies entirely on what each gamer is looking for. This may appear to be a lame response, but it's true. If cost is a big consideration, Minecraft may be the best option. The fact that players can do so much with the base versions of the game justifies its cost. Roblox, on the other hand, may be superior game for gamers who values a variety of gameplay and social components. What are your thoughts on this? Which games do you believe is the most suitable for you and your child? Please share your thoughts in the comment box below. I'm going to read over all of your remarks. That concludes today's discussions. I hope you found the video entertaining. If you did, ease it with a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel and set on post notifications for more illuminated videos. We're looking forward to see you guys in our upcoming video.